Hello everyone, welcome to Unmax. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a very simple interior in Brenda rendered in Cycles. Just don't forget to click the like button, subscribe, give a thumbs up to stay tuned for more. So I used the cube scale to make the floor, then I set an X code to make the walls. Added a new cube scale and duplicated the one for the window, then added two balloons on the house and selected the cubes as the objects. After that, I added two mirrors and mirrored the cube three times across its side, then hide all the cubes to make the door and window cutout. But don't forget to hide them in the render. For the roof, I used the cube moved upscale. Then I used an add-on called Building Tools. The link is given below to make our roof simple and easy. Then adjust the camera to give a correct position. For the door, I used an add-on called Akmesh. Go to the preferences add-on and enable it. So I used some of its models like the door, windows, and the Venetian blind. So I made some of the models and others were downloaded from Sketchfab and the poly event. The link is given in the description below. Then you put it and set them in position. I'm happy with the inside of our room. Just drop them anywhere you feel like. For the shading, that was easy because some of the models had their textures. Others I textured them like the walls, roof and made some procedural materials. For some of them, when that is done, let's set up the project for rendering. So for the render engine we are using Cycles and let's use the GPU because they render a lot fast and for the color management this is optional you can go with the default settings but for me I use standard on view transform local on AVI contrast and resolution set to 4K with the less samples then go to view layers properties, passes and enable denoising data after that go to render, render image and wait for the render to finish when rendering is finished switch to compositing tab and start compositing your image and even use the photoshop for compositing this is option if you ask. Thanks for watching and don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. So we appreciate so much to those who subscribed and followed us on our Instagram account Animax Studios. See you next time.